Hello students and welcome to this discussion on final accounts of sole proprietors. By the end of this discussion, you would have understood, you would have learned how to prepare a trial balance, how to prepare a profit and loss account, how to prepare a balance sheet. You would have understood the interrelationship between these three statements. You will also learn certain adjustments, year-end adjustments like outstanding expenses, accrued income, provision for bad debts, etc. You would also learn how to prepare a manufacturing account, which is a part of the final accounts of a manufacturing sole proprietorship business. So happy learning. The course of our discussion would be structured as below. First, we would understand what the final accounts are, what part of the accounting process they belong to, why we prepare the final accounts. <clears throat> the final accounts would actually consist of a trading account, profit and loss account, and a balance sheet. These three we would individually understand how to prepare them, what are the components and then also finally the relationship between trading, profit and loss and balance sheet. These three statements would be the final accounts of trading organizations. sole proprietors in the trading business, in the business of trading. And the sole proprietor who also has manufacturing activities would in addition to this prepare a manufacturing account. So we will first go through the final accounts of a sole proprietor of a trading organization. Also understand the year end adjustments like outstanding expenses, income received in advance, adjustments for provision for bad debts. We will discuss some such year and adjustments and then move on to understanding how to prepare a manufacturing account, which would be in addition to the trading profit and loss and balance sheet. 